in today's world, people are very sensitive. We don't want anybody insulting us or trying to make us look that we are not good enough. And we see Jesus today in the gospel calling people children of the devil. In fact, Jesus in John chapter 8 verse 44 called the Pharisees, said to them, your father is the devil. He is a liar and the father of lies. So what does it mean? Well, first of all, as we read in the gospel, first God planted good seeds, the children of God. So God created everyone good. But somebody becomes the children of the devil when they allow themselves to be controlled by the devil, by the lies of the devil. They have lost the sense of understanding their identity, who they really are, who God is. When our lives are controlled by lies, when we, our lives are controlled by negative thoughts, negative understanding of ourselves, this is how the evil one controls us. Francis is in Christ. In today's word, we are reminded that evil will always be there. There's no such thing as a perfect person. There's no such thing as a perfect marriage or perfect church or perfect world. Right from the very beginning, even though God created everything good, but evil has come into this world and is controlling us. So the choice before us is whether we want to continue to be a sinner or we want to be a redeemed sinner. A sinner is one who's controlled by the evil one, controlled by lies. My sin will never be forgiven. I've done something so bad, I'm gone forever. My life is hopeless. Whereas a redeemed sinner knows that God loves that person. Jesus has died for that person. And now he lives a victorious life. That at the end, yes, evil as we see in the gospel today, those who, who do evil, they will face judgment. But those who follow Jesus, who experience the freedom that Jesus comes to bring, through his death and resurrection, will shine like the sun. The choice is ours today, Francis Christ. Let us think today of our identity. Let us not allow the evil one to poison our minds. Let us experience the freedom that God loves brings us, that we are a child of God, and God is our loving Father. God bless.